Good morning. Today is um, Friday, February 27th, and it's the Longhorn News time, baby. Let's get into it. I'm Jackson. I'm Derek. This is Jackson. I'm Jackson. Yeah. We're ready. It's Thursday night. And now for your Longhorn menu. For second chance breakfast, you get strawberry delight pastry. And for lunch, you get macaroni and cheese with some meaty balls and pepperoni pizza or chef salad. Your sides are choice. Your sides, you don't get a choice for your sides. These are your sides. So you get whole wheat roll with jelly, some baked beans, some cucumber slices with the good old ranch cup, and some pineapple and bananas. And now, to Jackson with your daily Longhorn announcements. Today is an end day. You forgot to say thank you, Derek. Thank you, Derek. Okay. Today is an end day. During seminar, there will be a grade check slash a five-minute meeting. Mm -hmm. Dur er, there will be a Scott City Community College rep at lunch in the Commons area. And there will be wrestling at State in Salina, but it's girls wrestling also. It's just girls wrestling. Just girls wrestling, not boys wrestling. Good luck, Millie. Yep, good luck. And now to Longhorn Trey for your Longhorn weather for your Longhorn day. <laughs> Thank you, Derek. Today's weather forecast, we have a high of 53 and a low of 26. With 20 mile per hour wind gusts coming in from the south. Now, on to our meme of the day, sponsored by Doritos. I think he wants me to put the herd on him. I think he wants you to put the herd on him. You think he wants me to put the herd on him? Yes, I do. Ah! Ah! Thank you, Trey. And now to Devin and Drew with Just the Facts with Devin and Drew. I'm Drew Hill. I'm Devin Hill. And this is Richie. And we're going to give you news around the world. Our first is... Europe prepares for pandemic as illness spreads from Italy. The, n the number of new infections outside China, China has outpaced those inside the country for the first time, according to the World Health Organization. Also, uh, research researchers have discovered the first animal that doesn't need oxygen to, oxygen to live. Uh, it's a tiny parasite that lives in salmon tissue and it evolves so it doesn't need oxygen to produce energy. And that's been your worldwide news. Thank you, Hillbros. That's a wrap for today. As always, we hope you enjoyed our daily newscast and we thank you for watching. This is me, Derek. And me, Jackson. Signing off. and welcome to the fourth day of National FFA Week. I hope that you are all dressed in your FFA gear today. If you haven't already, please check your email to see all of the exciting events that are going on this week. And don't forget, the Kiss the Pig coin drive is going on right now. The teacher with the most coins at the end of the week will be kissing the pig, so don't forget to bring all of your extra coins. And also, a reminder that trivia prizes will be given out to the first correct answer, and the first 10 correct answers will be entered into a prize drawing. Please email Ms. Vinjohn with your answers. Round 10 FFA trivia questions will be on the news. Round 11 FFA trivia questions will be posted in the Holcomb FFA Twitter page. Round 12 FFA trivia questions will be sent out in your email. If you're dressed up in your FFA gear today, email Ms. Vinjohn a picture to be entered, for a, entered in a drawing for prizes. Round 12 FFA trivia is, what is the FFA motto? All right, your announcements for today. Today is an R day, right? You were answering. No! You, you were answering my Snapchats. No. Yeah, you were. It's an N day, not an R day. Who did you answer? <laughs> no one. No one. As no. it says, deliver twenty seconds ago. <laughs> what did you say? Nothing. All right. It's a picture of my face. Okay. Okay. Okay.